and welcome to this week's episode of Discover Down Under. That's Brooke, I'm Tim, that's the Southern Ocean, and we're here in Albany. It's great to be back at one of our favourite spots. Tim, the scenery here is just absolutely amazing. I can't wait to visit Albany in a rather unusual way. Oh, cool. And I'm going to pop into Walpole, which is about 90 minutes down the road, and that brook is where the giants live. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, I do. <laughs> All right. Well, we'll also see some fantastic top tourist parks, and, of course, the $20 challenge is getting to the business end. It sure is, Brookie. And the big question we'll be answering is... What have we done with the D-Max? What have we done with the D-Max? Well, I don't know. I thought you had it. I thought you had it. Well, it's normally here. Let's go find it. I think I did leave it at the pub last night. Oh, man, I hate it when it goes off by itself. <laughs> Albany is on the southern coast of Western Australia, just over 400 k's from the state's capital, Perth. Albany was home to Australia's last whaling station. But today, Brookie and I are off to visit another marine creature at the Old Marin Farm. How long have you been a marin farmer, Carl? Um, we've been here for 11 years now. I yeah. actually hadn't even seen a marin when we brought the place, so this oh, is really? the first we ever saw of them, yeah. So did you have to read up about it? or? Yeah, we read up a lot about it and um, we had a go at getting them going a lot. So what are the favourite cafe dishes? We do probably the barbecue marin, where they're cut, sliced in half, and we barbecue them on a, with some um, wasabi butter. And um, the farm feast, so we do platters where they're... Um, they're just boiled. And I've heard a pizza. You do yeah, a... we do a very, uh, they're very popular, the marin pizzas. We do a yabby pizza and um, we also have a few trout. So we have that on the pizza sometimes as well. Oh, yeah. Steady on, Tim. I'm sure there's more to do before we eat. We've got some segues happening here now. It's a good way to have a look around the property. That would get your appetite built up. <laughs> yeah, I tell you. Yeah. No, Tim, I haven't done that before. Well, me either. Do you want to do that and then let's, like, like eat a marinara pizza? <laughs> Turn this way. Or the other way. Or the other way. <laughs> Step so one, right. learn how to ride a Segway. Oh. Lean more towards me. That's weird. It's, 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 it's compensating and I'm trying to compensate yeah, as well. Stop yeah. talking, Tim, and listen to Sharon. I want to get out on the tracks. Come on, Tim, let's go. Oh, shush. Move I'm coming. It, move it. Keep up, Brooke. Woohoo! Here I come. This so beats walking, though. It sure does. <laughs> you know what? I like it better than walking now. I have never seen a plate like this, Tim. I know. That's why I loved my job. And Brookie is so hungry. I'm loving, <laughs> and it's just right there, and we've got to get into it. Pizza. Oh, oh wow. thank you. Thanks, Jazz. Thank you. She didn't forget. Oh, wow. Well, Tim, look at that. <laughs> we're not going to need dinner. Oh, look at that. <sighs> Tim and I are loving it here at the Albany Emu Beach Holiday Park. It's just fantastic, and I can't believe we're only 30 metres from the beach. Yeah, definitely. Um, it's great for uh, people to come to Albany and um, check out all the sites and things like that. We've got about 160 odd sites here, a lot of chalets and studios, which are about 40 uh, accommodation. So you've got your studios that are great for families that yeah. can sleep four. Uh, we've got our large chalets that can sleep six. We've got one big uh, large uh, villa that can sleep eight, which is great for a oh, big, big family. family. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. exactly it. And we've got little uh, motel units, which is uh, good for just uh, an overnight stay. Yeah. They are quite small, but um, quite modern. Well, you've got plenty of powered sites, you've got ensuite sites, you've got unpowered sites, and I saw you can even fit fifth wheelers in there. Yeah. Yes, we can, yeah, we do cater for fifth wheelers. I saw there's a colourful camp kitchen, plenty of activities for the kids. Yes, we've got a um, great jumping pillow up there, which is a great uh, draw card. Have you had a go on it? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. Well, how do you know it's great? Oh, you can see lots of kids there, so they're always having fun. And um, we have a great barbecue area down the bottom of the park, yeah. which people love, and uh, it's a good way of meeting people too. You're not wrong there, Brad. Tim and I have run into Margie here at the park. 
Margie, you don't look like a grey nomad. You're way too young for that. Are you really touring the country? <laughs> um, yes, I'm touring the country. Six months. Are you by yourself, Margie? No, my husband's with me. He's doing all the driving. OK. So where is he now? Fishing. Oh, of course. <laughs> like, every great husband should go and fish. Go That's catch right. dinner. I wish I was with him. Not that I don't love you, Margie. <laughs> like... <laughs> Catches and I eat it. Tell me, what do you think of this park? Um, beautiful park, very well maintained. It's really lovely. I can see that they put a lot of effort into keeping it nice. Mm. Yeah, it's nice and green and lush and it is. so close to the beach as well. Oh, absolutely. Tim, are you thinking what I'm thinking? I'm thinking right. Margie will be a fantastic person All to right. do our $20 cooking challenge. Man, I was thinking that I was thirsty. <laughs> <laughs> Have you heard about it? All, we, all you have to do yep. is cook for Tim and myself. Cook something delicious for lunch. Mm -hmm. Look, that'll we'll be give... easy peasy. Yeah. Oh, 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 we didn't even have to twist her arm. <laughs> Tim, it's... give her the 20. Give I her the have 20. to quickly. <laughs> yeah, thank you, thank oh, Margie. <laughs> <laughs> so what we, uh, all you have to do is use whatever you've got in the van and use that $20 to buy local produce. I'll probably have something left over for a bottle of wine. Oh, 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 oh excellent. Oh.